around the corner. Great Mark Morkham. And he hands off to Daly from 52 to the square. Oh, wow. Across the face. Poor kick. Poor kick. Had a go on over the oh. top. For one behind. Blazed away Jack Daly. I reckon six, Trev Beard might have told him too. Yeah, 6'6", 42 square, 6'5", 41 the Storm, 21 and a half gone in the second term. Thanks to Browns Hi-Fi, this is Fresh FM. We love local grand final football. Troller brings it back into play for the Storm. Poor kick, he kicked it straight to two square players. Geary takes the mark unopposed, right on forward 50. Now he runs around as Jack from 51 metres. He's only got one intention, go for home, and he's hit the stick. Oh, it took him on though, did Jack? He kicked a point. So Golden Square go to 6-7-43. The Storm are 6-5-41. 22-minute mark of the second term of the grand final, thanks to Bulger's Granite Transformations. Schultz chips to himself, takes oh. a bounce, gets around, and now runs to the scoreboard and drives them long down the line. Bristow back with the flight, couldn't take it. Bell, handball to Anderson. Back through the traffic, square go inside, forward 50. Baird sets himself at the back and comes through and takes the mark over Wayne Schultz. 52 out, plays on, right foot kick, right to the goal line. His opponent in Ash Trollope floats behind the play and marks right on the last line of defence for the Strathfield say Storm. Poor option. Look, yeah, looking for an option, short, and finds Hall in the rifle brigade pocket, still right on the last line of defence for Strathfield say. Hall from the back pocket, pops it up, all oh, the flyers are there at half forward for Golden Square, nobody can bring it down. Pack develops, just tough and hard, daily works, head over the football, can't get it out. And Pye will ball it up just outside forward 50 for Golden Square. They lead by two points, approaching half time in the grand final. Up they go. Compton won this one. Hit it towards half forward. Kick across the body by Morecambe. High. Inside forward 50. Carter ran at the pack with intent. Never got there. Schultz came up with a crumb. Great hands to Northrop. He's a released Everington. He runs through the middle with two bounces. Then goes bang. Inside forward 50. And Finds Bartholomew. Great work from the storm from the back pocket to a mark 30 metres out directly in front. And Big Tommy's got an opportunity to put the Stormers in front. Joffa, they look really dangerous when they can get out and start running when that every turn and those sort of types, they break away the pack pretty quick, don't they? I yeah, used to be like that bear. I used to be dangerous when I could get out. They eat the grass up pretty quickly and, uh, you know, I mean, they've got to stick in Everington's hand more, I reckon. Bartholomew from 35 metres out, dead in front goes Bain. And he puts the Strat Storm in front. They go to 7 5 47, a four point lead. 6 5 40, something or other, 43. One, thank uh, you. 6 7. 6 7 43, Golden Square, 7 5 47, a storm. 24 minute mark of the second term. The difference between that, Everington, the ball got in the hands of Bartholomew. Jack Daly could have done the same thing at the other end of Travis Bear. They had opportunities, they just made yeah. two really bad decisions. Kick to, cool, cool kick to no one. Ball back in the middle, and they gift the Storm the lead. Lloyd by hand to Rosa, formidable combination. Up towards half forward, Baird was just worked off it by Trollope, who's been great so far for the Storm. And as Trollope kicks to the wing, he's going to go straight back to Simon Rosa. Well run, Everington applied the fist. Ground level footy, Rosa can't keep it in. Overline out of bounds will be thrown in centre wing. Grandstand side of the QEO, 7-5 the Storm, 6-7 Golden Square in the grand final for 2013. 25 minutes gone in the second term. Bradley goes through the traffic, oh. poor handball, let's haul in. Hall goes to Everington, Everington runs, left foot kick inside, forward 50, directed for Sharp, didn't quite get there. Going through was Baird, that was Josh. He just saw it over the line and out of bounds, it'll be thrown back in. Well, what's Reese Bradley thinking, seriously? That was uh, a bit of a brain fade, throw in forward pocket for the Storm, closing on half time, up they go, knocked to the front by Lee, taken by Nick Smith, got it to Hall, who found some space, 30 out, and then went bang and missed everything. Well, I tell you, he, that, whoa, let off. Another brain fade. I suddenly reckon Hall thought, gee, I've got it, I'm 30 out and I'm in space, and he's panicked. He's kicked it out on a full. Penalty free kick, right in the back pocket. Anderson's got it for Golden Square, goes across goal, and he's kicked it to Mildred. What is going on? What?
What is going on? This is Sammy Mildred's pocket too. This will yeah. be mark, oh. mark this one down. Kicked one from here last <laughs> week. Yeah, we'll kick this off. Where's uh, the percentage football? Oh, look, they've just uh, look, they've just shows. Uh, Pressures of grand final. Storm put them under the heat. And, well, Mildred, uh, even the very best can fall. He'll kick the distance. He'll only kick it probably 40 metres, but it's a tight angle, deep in the pocket. Lay down, Bazaar. In he comes, goes for home and sold him, Joffa. Kicked it out of bounds on the fall. Oh, get off his case. Let off for the Bulldogs. So it remains the storm in front by four points at the 26 minute mark of the second term of the Bendigo Football Netball League Grand Final. So Bradley to take the kick in and he needs to make better use of this than his last possession. Goes down the line and doesn't. And Chris Lee takes the mark. In between wing and half forward, pull side of the ground here at the QEO, call to play on his lead. Goes back inside forward, 50. Shark from the back. Second grab, mark. No, play on, said the umpire. Ball at ground level, wrapped up. And we'll have a ball up, 45 out from the Storm goal. Thought Lockie Sharp had enough of it. Umpire disagreed. And it'll be a ball up, right on centre half forward for the Storm. They lead by four points. Up goes Compton. Down at ground level. Ladson through the traffic. That was Matt. Forward pocket. Mildren well tackled by Young as he tried to kick it. And Archard picks it up in defence for the square. Drives them up towards half back. And they get a mark. And they just need to relieve the pressure here to Golden Square. Jack Daly goes down the line. Bared the target. Trollop did well. Ground level footy. Rosa keeps it in. Handball over the top. Morecambe sits under it. Got trying to get away from Lee. The big fella brought him down. And it's a free kick with Chris Lee to the storm in between half back and wing out of side. Stood up today, uh, big Chris Lee. He's taken a couple of good marks around the ground and also made a really good tackling two or three times. So the storm just control the ball, little kick from Lees, okay, they've got it with Pryor at half back. Goes long down the line, plenty up in the marking contest, nobody can take it, crumb by the storm, through the traffic, lovely old punt kick inside forward, 50 Young backs himself and takes a strong mark in defence for the Bulldogs. So Dale Young with the football, inside his own defensive 50. 28 and a half gone, second term. Shocking little kick, chance for the Storm. They've got some numbers. Hand pass long from just outside forward 50. Scrappy kick into the forward pocket. Taken by Ladson across the body. Can't find the target. Floods there, he leaves it. Work back in the direction of a teammate there for Storm who's just blazed away. Chance down there for Lloyd to take it. Runs across his own defensive goal. Kicks it high. Donigan under it. Oh, never got near it, Harry. I don't know what happened to that. Chance for the Storm still. Work to Bonnie. Free, free kick. That's why I picked out a free kick. Very lucky, Donigan. Oh, no. Donigan. Donigan. Very, very lucky. Oh, it's gone back to Harry, who's got it just inside defence of 50. Was that from his contested mark from a minute ago? Yep. Doesn't matter. Half time in the grand final. Four point lead to the Storm. 7 5, 47 the Storm. Golden Square. 6 7. 43 at half time. It's been a cracker of a game of footy. There's a bit of feeling in it too at half time. A few pushes and shoves being exchanged. But it's been a great first half of grand final football right here at Fresh and Local Life Sport as they just continue to exchange pleasantries, the players, and now they break it up. Golden Square will go to the pool change rooms, Strathstorm, back into the QEO, the grandstand change rooms. Joffa, great first half of footy. Uh, storm up by four points.